everybody today what i'm gonna do do you know well today is my most fun video because i'm going to do a science experiment science is my favorite subject and experimenting is my more favorite than science because you know we get to try different things today we'll see how a fountain works with some simple equipments that we can find at home first we need a water bottle and its cap there should be two holes in this cap where we can insert two straws of equal length some glue tag glue tag and two cups one filled with water basically the wash bottle should be filled with a little bit of water like about this much and finally we need a high surface so that we can put the cup of water on top in the cap we have to insert the straws like this insert one like this much use some glue tag to cover the hole and we need to make it airtight Okay, the next one should go in a bit further, like about this much, maybe a bit little, yeah, and we have to cover it all too, so that it could be totally airtight. into the cup with water and this straw is going to fill up this cup it's going to create a fountain scene Whoa. what is happening is that There's more pressure, but it flows down here again. That's what's happening. Ooh, I guess that's enough. See, this is already full, and this is totally empty, and this is really less water. The pressure is the reason for everything that happened in this experiment. So when this has more pressure. And this also has pressure. Pressure flows down with the water to here, and pressure decreases inside the bottle, and pressure from here goes into here to this tube, basically straw, and then pressure again flows up, and that's what's happening like a cycle. <laughs> it will never work because there's no more water here. And this full of water. This is the basic science principle. The water will always flow from a high pressure area to a low pressure area. Based on this principle, all the water tanks and water fountains and whatever has water flow works. Thanks for watching. Try this experiment. It's really fun. 
you can use the materials you can find at home to do this experiments. Very simple. Thank you for watching. Please up, share, and comment on this amazing experiment. If you're new, don't forget to subscribe. Bye.